Cezanne Dupree has an amazing passion for artistry and performance and looks forward to giving her best in every show. She reinvented her style and look by leading a healthy and productive lifestyle. If she wins the title of Miss California Gold, Cezanne believes on bringing back elegance for all to admire and enjoy. Her on-camera experience in media training will be an asset as she spreads the word of her charity, her fundraising efforts, and makes personal appearances. Cezanne's words to live by is to be true to yourself and to never worry when people talk about you. Only worry when they're not talking about you. Cezanne's charity is the Parkinson's Association of Northern California. Ladies and gentlemen, contestant number four, Miss Cezanne Dupree. Cezanne, if you will please step to the microphone right here, and you will answer for us the same question all the girls have. Why did you select your charity of choice, which is the Parkinson's Association? Icon. I appreciate that. So I really love this question because my family has actually been struck very closely with Parkinson's. Uh, about two and a half years ago, my mom was diagnosed with Parkinson's and it's a very advancing case. And the trick with this is that it doesn't take your mind away, it simply takes away the body functions. So she's not able to dip, do simple things as take a shower and walk. So the foundation is actually donated to her a walker and one of the little go-kart scooters that she can drive around the safe way. And what's really great about that is those are so expensive and not a lot of people stop and give to Parkinson's. So I'm excited to introduce that here, this new charity into the California Gold pageant. And I'm really excited to do something for the community and very happy to honor my mother. If one of your younger relatives were to come out to you, what advice would you give them? Well, I think if any of my younger nephews or nieces came out to me, the first thing is I would say, do you. Be you, be free, do what you need to do. Because that is something that nobody ever told me when I was growing up. And they always tried to tell me to be something else, be someone else, do something different. And I would tell them to do exactly what they feel like doing, what comes from inside their heart. And number two, I would always be there for them. Because I know that this is a time when youth can struggle, there's a lot of, of activities out there. So I would make sure that in this lifestyle, they would vote the right way in our lifestyle. So I, I welcome it with open arms. Ladies and gentlemen, contestant number four, four, Cezanne Dupree.
Here, consider raising your dozen number four, say, Zondu Free.